I had a, a good friend ask me about these HomeWise estimating tools, and I thought I would run the numbers, and uh, they were interesting, so I thought I'd share them with all of you guys. Um, we're talking about 535 square feet, all right? Um, got the labor here, got the materials. Um, premium quality, let's say selected better. Licensed and bonded, that's me. Basic shape, that's a rectangle. Um, this is basically the room. Uh, 20 by 24, 25, something like that. I have it actually dimensioned out in, uh, in layout. Let's pull that up. So, we're talking about a room that is uh, 26.4 feet and then 19.9, four sides, wide open, no, uh, no obstacles. Uh, 16 styles, MDF center panels here. Um, so yeah, we're talking about quite a bit of material when it comes down to it. Uh, I actually went ahead and did a spreadsheet of it because I think it's interesting. Um, so if I was going to estimate material on this, uh, you know, 290 linear feet, that's with no drop. Room like this, I'd probably add 10% drop. Buck twenty nine in lineal, and that's an extended price. A two dollar chair rail, and buck and a quarter panel molding. Now that's, you know, pretty cheap anymore for panel molding. Uh, buck seventy five is your higher range of that. So we'll call it buck twenty five just for kicks. Uh, you'll need six sheets of quarter inch MDF. That's thirty five bucks a sheet now. You know, if it stays that way. Uh, closer to 40 probably if you can find it uh, baseboard that's just a basic MDF baseboard right there uh, five and a quarter like uh, colonial let's say 350 I think something like that for like a Windsor one so that's where your material cost is at now that's uh, with panel molding without you know something more like that then that's your linear footage without panel molding. And now, so you've got to pocket screw all the styles and rails, lay everything out, um, take 50 linear feet an hour. Um, if that's 400 linear per day in output, that's like peak production for a journeyman carpenter. Um, so you'd have 16.7 hours with panel molding, 9.6 without, almost double just to add panel molding, right? Um, so yeah, estimating 150 an hour, that's HomeWise's number. Now we're talking, uh, this price with, uh, panel molding, without panel molding, and this price with, but we're not doing too bad until we get here. Let's have a look at this room. Have you ever seen a room? in a Denver home that's 26 feet by 20 feet unobstructed. You have outlets here. You have other trades to coordinate. You have to load in, load out, and you have to get there. All your operating costs and overhead. And then you also have to make a profit. Otherwise it's just a job with homework. Um, so yeah. You can cover most of your direct costs with these numbers. But if you try to adjust for a complex shape with one level, it gives you 0.2 hours of overage. That simply doesn't cut it. Um, complex shape with two plus levels. And you're getting closer, but it still doesn't quite cut it. To really put out a custom grade product, you um, you're going to get screwed if you follow this, just so you know.